Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video we are going to talk about Ahrefs. We are going to cover the pros and cons, I'll tell you more about Ahrefs and then we'll check up the pricing so we exactly know what is it worth. So, Ahrefs is uh, an SEO tool that enables companies and uh, website owners to grow the organic traffic of uh, their websites. Users can even research their competitors to understand what is working for uh, them and the reason for their higher ranks. All this and more are neatly charted, in, charted out in organic search report that showcases uh, the amount of traffic that is driven by each keyword. The top pages uh, section also shows the primary pages that send the most traffic to the website. The tool holds data for about 150 million keywords in the United States alone. This powers uh, the Keyword Explorer that uh, sifts through thousands of relevant keyword, uh, keyword suggestions. The total data database of keywords stands at 3 billion. Additional data points such uh, as the keyword difficult difficulty score and advanced research metric shows uh, users which keywords to target. Ahrefs is also attributed with running the world's largest index of live uh, backlinks. It's made for basically all types of businesses. If it's small, medium or large, it's completely up to you. And also freelancers. They are located in Singapore and they are providing still very nice support. As you can see, uh, they, uh, are, they have two programs, pay monthly or pay annually. They claim that paid annually get two months uh, free. This is quite nice. And uh, let's uh, take a look on a monthly paid program. With light, you, we are looking at 89 uh, euros, essential data for small businesses and hobby projects and many more options than standard which is 179 plus history and we are at the moment looking for epis and epis are in advance yeah so you have to prepare some money if you want to integrate it with uh like they proclaim full potential of the data so it's 900 euros you can go for like 749 with a yearly plan but that's still a lot of money because it's like 9k a year if you're a bigger company i pro i, I think that you can spare that money but if you are like a freelancer that's a hell of a lot of money so thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one have a great day and goodbye